midpoint between two points. So if we're given two points, we can actually find the point that's going to be in the direct middle of those two points. So what does that even mean? Let's have a look. Let's draw up a simple number plane. That's one, that's minus one. And if we had a point here and a point here, the point in the middle would obviously be the origin. And that's exactly what we're going to do. But we're going to do that for any two points. So if we had a different two points, let's say this one and this one, we'd be finding the middle point between those two, where could be somewhere here, where that distance was equal to that distance. So let's have a look how we can do this. There's a formula we can use where the midpoint M, because midpoint is going to be a coordinate, so we've got our open bracket for our coordinate equals x1 plus x2 divided by 2, and the y coordinate will be y1 plus y2 over 2, where we're given two points x1, y1, and another point, x2, y2. So let's find, let's go, here. let's find the midpoint between minus 4, minus 2, and 3, minus 8. I'm going to graph it, but you don't have to, just so we can see what's going on. So, go by twos, minus four, minus two, that's two and four. Okay, so let's call this point A and this point B. So minus 4 minus 2 is going to be about there. And 3 minus 8 will be about there. So we're expecting our midpoint to roughly be about here. Let's go ahead and use the formula where we've got x1 plus x2 all over 2 for our x coordinate and y1 plus y2 over 2 for our y coordinate. Let's go ahead and label these points with our appropriate value. So this will be x1 and y1. We could have used the other point for x1 and y1, but I just used that one. Then this will be x2 and y2. Let's go ahead and sub them in. So x1 is minus 4 plus x2 is 3 all over 2 y1 is minus 2 plus y2, which is minus 8 over 2. Let's simplify. So minus 4 plus 3 gives us minus 1 over 2. And minus 2 plus minus 8, well, plus minus is going to change into a minus. So we've got minus 2 minus 8 is minus 10. Minus 10 divided by 2 is minus 5. And sorry, I used my scale wrong because I was going up by twos. Minus four is about there, so that point should be there, not over there. So the midpoint we're expecting should have been about here. So let's have a look, and yeah, it does look like it matches up. So the midpoint we calculated is minus a half and five and minus a half looks there and minus five looks there. So you can see that it did find the middle exactly of the two points that were given.